Hello. <laughs> it is I, Yummy the Ferret here with um, another unboxing. <laughs> and we're going to be opening up the Borderlands Super Duper Diamond Collector's Edition. Are you ready, Randy? <laughs> yep, he's ready. GameStop decided to keep it in the box to keep it safe. So let's see how safe it is. Huh. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> How am I supposed to do this? Oh my god. Ah, there it is. <laughs> oh. ah. So there is the box. Um, it has, looks like it has all the contents in the front. Uh, looks pretty swiggity swag. And on the side, it says, what does it say? Children of Vault or something like that? And then on this back side, it's black. And then on this side, it's uh, a symbol there. And then on this side, <laughs> it looks like this. Oh my gosh, this thing is massive. But that's good. It's worth every penny, right? So let's go ahead and get this thing open. Let's see. Probably the best way would be to do this. Oh. It's a little bit different now. It's even more decked out. Look at that. That is beautiful. Isn't that right, Randy? <laughs> Look at that. It's crazy. The bottom's nothing special. Don't even need to worry about it. Alright. Here we go. Open that up. <laughs> to see another box. We got the Loot Diamond official box. Oh my god. Oh. Holy crap, holy. Oh. So inside the box here we got instructions for opening it up. Very fancy. We'll probably need those very soon. And then we also got the deluxe edition of the game, and it's a deluxe box. Not too bad. I will probably be throwing this away because I never keep them. But that's it. Okay. Now we have to find a place to put this. Oh my kid! All right. We'll need the instructions. So, it's got like an on and off button on it. Well, let's see. So we're going to flip down the thing, and then flip it up, and then open it up. Yeah, on the back here there's like, digital out. Does it do something? Not yet. It's like speakers on it? I have no clue. Oh, Bluetooth free operation. Okay. You have a latch open on this side. Latch. One's open already. Hello, Randy. Let's go ahead and. Hello. Hello. Oh my god. Hi, Randy. Yes. Here we go. Wait, how does it go again? I told you I'd need these. So it like. It was like. Wait. So that's how it is closed. You open it like this, and then it goes... I don't know how it goes. Wait. Am I... am I... <laughs> I'm crazy. Wait. Wait. It's painful. Maybe that's just how it goes. I don't know, that's not what it looks like, though. Well, forget it. We'll, we'll figure it out. So, first things first, we got one of these. That 
inside. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. More religious symbolism for the for the fans of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Behind there, there's another thing. I'm. Nope, if there's anything actually in here. This might just be a display case, to be honest with you. Look at that. Not too shabby. I'm not sure exactly what this is. There's nothing in there. But we'll just leave it like that. And there we go. Next up, we have... What's this? box design looks very borderlands. We need our trusty knife, skin knife. So inside here we got a collection of keychains. I'm not gonna, you know what, I shouldn't take them out. They look pretty cool though. There's like a spiked ball triangle. Oh! I'm not sure what that, it looks like a kind of like a borderline symbol there. It looks, like a, it looks like a vault key as well. Pretty cool. Keychains though, I mean, what, what I am I in a elementary school? Huh? Gonna put those on my backpack. Alright, so let's take out the foam here. I think that's how it's supposed to be. There we go. So we have our collectible figurines, and it's just every character from the game in like a metal die cast form, I guess you would say. Pretty cool. Apparently, this is a Loot Crate exclusive. Uh, not sure what that's supposed to mean. If it's just supposed to be for this box, or if it's actually like Loot Crate as in the company that just died. But, I don't know. These look cool, though. They definitely look really cool. I would gladly show those off in, in my home. It's not a piece of foam here. That's cool. So, Sanctuary 3 1 by 200 scale plastic model. Diamond loot plate. Okay. Giant loot plate crate. I can't speak anymore. So that's what that is. I wonder if you have to build it. I'm thinking you have to build it, so we'll open that up at a later date. But that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Also, we have... Looks like a, a map. To hang on your wall. So you can chart your course in the game. It's a... Belt like material, I guess I would say. Not like something you would lay down on, but kind of cool. No, sm well, kind of a smell. Kind of interesting to get. And last but not least, we have P1 package, Torx package delivery system. Let's see what's in here. This is, I mean, it looks exactly like it would probably look like in the game. I love that kind of cell shading. Let's see what's inside. Very carefully, open this up. I'm not sure what's in here. To the side. Oh, oh, look at that. There we go. Like painted portrait. It's a nice quality, too. Let's see what else we got. I'm guessing this is just, just going to be all the different Vault Hunters. Let's do it like a Yu Gi Oh! video. What do we got next? Cool. Yeah, these are pretty. Sp these are pretty slick. They look really nice. I know I'm looking at them upside down, but even upside down they look pretty cool. So yeah, that would be... I mean, those are frame-worthy. <laughs> to be honest with you. 
So there we go, we got the, everything out of the box here. Let's go ahead and see if this is actually like a thing we have to build. Where'd my trusty saber go? There it is. Did it wrong. Sanctuary 3, Diamond Loop Crate Crest Kit. I still can't talk. So, yeah, it's like a snap together. Like a snap together thing, would you say? There's all the pieces, parts here. Pretty interesting. That that's, This will probably annoy me to all hell to try to put it together, but I will follow the instructions as best as I can. Hopefully, there. Dumb enough for a psycho to read. But yeah, pretty cool. Um, I thought it was supposed to be like... I thought it was supposed to be like the city sanctuary, but I guess Sanctuary 3, I didn't know what it was at first, but... Not too shabby. Not too shabby. So I'm definitely going to be putting this together in the near future. But there we go. That is the... What is it called? Diamond Loot Crate Box Edition? Whatever you want to call it. On the back, oh, here's what the back looks like. Uh, there's like a power button here. I'm wondering if it's supposed to be like automatic opening or something like that. Not sure. But there's some stuff on here that look like buttons that aren't actually buttons. So maybe they're just fake and I'm just stupid. That could be it. Anyways, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you guys next time.